Peaches, welcome to Previewed, where friends don't let friends watch trailers alone. I'm Adam. And I'm Jay. And today, we're going to talk about Justice League coming back, because Zack Snyder's cut of the movie is a thing that's happening now? I guess it's a thing. So, what happened, first, there's a, there's a little teaser announcement trailer that we're going to take a look at real quick. Uh, but yeah, if you guys don't know, for whatever reason you've been un under a rock or not paying attention to pop culture news because of other major reasons. Yeah, you know. Uh, so Society crumbling and, and, and so whatnot. Slowly but surely. Uh, <laughs> hey, hang on. Uh, don't leave the planet yet because the Zack Snyder cut of <laughs> Justice League is coming out next year on HBO Max. Yep, we all earned it. Uh, yes, after, I guess, uh, years of the internet being like, hey, release the Snyder cut for this movie forces combined and people realized that I guess that HBO or AT&T or whatever the company that owns Warner Brothers and, it's AT&T uh, hey we need to make money hey we need to drop people to HBO Max because not many people I don't think are using HBO Max hey let's is get, that already out I think so oh maybe I don't know they <laughs> haven't done a very good job of not, marketing their not product exactly no but in, a, in an effort to be like hey HBO Max is a thing hey the Snyder Cut of Justice League that the internet wanted. Uh, so here's a little teaser announcement and then we'll get to the figuring out if this is a good idea or not. Sounds good. Here we go, three, two, one, play. Hey guys, thought I might uh, crash your little watch party. I have a question that is the mother of all our questions as a fandom. When will you release the Snyder Cut? There it is. Yes. There it is. It's a hard question. I don't know. What do you think, Henry? I reckon you should show it. <laughs> We're doing it. So get ready. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, interesting little, interesting way of divulging that information. I don't think this is a great idea. Really? Yeah, I I don't think this is a good see, idea. I, see, I, I'm kind of ambivalent about it, if I'm being honest, but mm -hmm. I just assumed you were going to be totally on board. Huh. I'm intrigued to see what it is, of yeah. course. Like, but, we're going to watch it. Oh my god, of course we're going to watch it, and we'll talk about it we next week. We should watch week. it together. I Absolutely, we should, we should do that. I don't think this is a good idea. Like, I want DC and Warner Brothers to do well in the movie market because they clearly haven't been. Uh, and they have the they have. There's the ability. Yes, it's there because we've seen it. One Woman did a fantastic job. Really good movie. Shazam, great movie. Great that fun. was a lot of fun. Finally saw it. I had a great time. Yeah, really. Just a really good family like comic book DC movie. Yeah. And Aquaman was also a lot of fun. Not quite as good as like Wonder Woman, like in a, from a story perspective, but it was fun. Yeah. It was a fun DC movie, and that all came after Justice League, right? Wonder Woman came after Justice League, right? Or was it before? I don't really remember. Sure. It was after Batman v Superman, which was not a great movie. The extended edition was better than the yeah. theatrical edition, uh -huh. but it still wasn't. Great. Yeah, it's fun moments. Sure, but it wasn't like I think we're still mockingly coming saying Martha as a, oh the reason why this is as because everyone's mother's name was Martha. We're still yeah. mocking that movie, and it's been what like four or five years since. Yeah, Justice League came and went. N nobody really liked it, and now there's like oh the Snyder Cut must have been better. Well, it's still. Was it? I feel like... Was it? I, here's the thing. I want the Snyder Cut to be good. I hope they fix it. I don't think, I don't think they necessarily need to be digging up this, this three-year-old movie. I don't think it, it really warrants it. Right? I hope they nail it. But also, like, you know what's going to make it even worse? If this is a Snyder Cut? It's worse. Yes! Like, yes. people are going to be like, Snyder Cut, Snyder Cut, Snyder Cut. I'm like, ah, uh, okay. I like. I see what you're doing there. Oh, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. 
Cool, man. I mean, because remember, Man of Steel came out and it would kind of slightly divide the fan base of like, why is Superman dark and gritty? Some people were okay with it. I liked Man of Steel. Some people were like, I, I liked like, it. I thought it was okay, but yeah. like not the Superman I'm looking for. Henry Cavill's fantastic, He's by amazing. the way. He's amazing. It's not his fault. Also, no. the fact that he showed up uh, in this little Zoom chat to talk about Justice League uh, Snyder's cut and he had a mustache on, I think is a poor choice. <laughs> <laughs> that's not, I mean, unless it was for a role or something, I don't, I think that's... Like, bro? Like, that's not... How, you gotta, how uh, could, hey, hey, man. Henry, we love you. Witcher 2, season 2, can't wait. Wh wh oh my God, why didn't you shave before coming on the Zoom chat? <laughs> Please, God, we don't need those flashbacks. But here's the thing, Jay. They're actually going to be reshooting things for this movie. No. It's not like they have all this no. footage and they're recutting the movie. They that have that so, can't be true. They, ha they are spending $20 million no, 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 on no, no, reshoots. No, 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 Yes. That's a waste of money. $20 million. Oh, this man, is what I saw. Oh, $20 million waste of money. for reshoots for the Snyder Cut. They're taking some of the stuff that was shot before Snyder left the project and Whedon took over. This isn't like the Donner cut of Superman what? 2. This is not... Where they had all the footage or some test footage that I could compile into the movie. They have to actually reshoot, make new, sh shoot new things that is finish like, Snyder's version it's of It's the it. show business equivalent of like losing all your money at the casino and then like hitting the ATM to be like, they're chasing it at this point. Like... It's been, here's the thing. If it had been like two years, sure. It's been like, what, like three, four? four? Yeah, it's like, it's not, the zeitgeist is, it's it's come and gone. It's also, we're in a post-endgame world. Endgame yeah. is, unst they, nailed it. They'll, they nailed it. You think super, super uh, superhero team-up movie, you're thinking yeah. Endgame. Till the end of time, Endgame. They can't even, Justice League, unfortunately, because I'm a DC guy, Cannot, yeah. as its, its current form, cannot touch not even. what Marvel has well, done. Well, here's the thing. And not everything Marvel does is not perfect. Like, no, I'm, no, not no, a, no. I'm not an apologist by any mm -mm. means. But like we were talking about this earlier. It's like, whether or not, like, you have issues with, like, Endgame and, like, the two la the two final Avengers movies. Like, they're not, they're not perfect. There's some problems there. But, like, but the boat floats, you know? And, like, it's it's got a firm idea. It knows exactly what it's doing, and it achieves that goal. Whether or not you, like, love where all the cup holders are, that's on. That, okay, understood. I don't know why cup holders was the first thing I thought of on a boat. I don't, I don't know. know. Like, Justice League, it's, like, it's got all some cool pieces, but, like, you put it in the water, and it's kind of like, I don't know uh, if we're going to make it across the lake, bud. Mm -hmm. I, I just feel like spending $20 million on a reshoot when there's, like, when there are people who really would like to make a movie and like have earned their shot are not going to get a movie because they're spending 20 million dollars saving a movie that's already completely and on 100 percent come out yeah is yeah. not it's a, it's basically they're trying to they're having a second shot at justice league which i don't know if it deserves a second shot also zack snyder's original plan was for a two-parter which then they cut it down to one part, which then Whedon took over and then re told that the whole thing. That actually makes... I, I think you could have told a better story in two parts oh. and, like, fleshed it out in a way that would have actually... Absolutely. ...made sense. But Can you tell me right now immediately who the bad guy is in Justice League? Was Who's it, the bad guy? Was it Steppenwolf? Sure. What's what's his deal? Uh, he's a, one of the generals of Apocalypse. Okay. If but you like, if you I, put I, a gun to my head, yeah. I would my brains yeah. would be all over the wall. Yeah, nobody has any idea. Yeah, they're like, ah, oh, he's got that weird hat. I don't know, like yeah. the Hat Man. Hat, sure, evil, the, the evil. bad guy we never built up. Yep, the yeah. haberdasher, the Hat Man. So the original, from what I've heard, Snyder's original plan was a two-part movie that got turned into one, and then he had to back away, and then Whedon took over. So they, a whole lot of things happened. They haven't exactly said what uh, form this. Snyder Cut will take. Will it be a whole new movie? I don't know. Will it be two movies, as is originally intended? Will it be a uh, limited time series of like six episodes of like 45 minutes? You know, might, might be two movies That'd be told cool. in like That's six cool. parts or that. Maybe something like that. This is the, the problem, the trap I think that Warner Brothers has fallen into. A bear now. trap. Because there's two ways this goes. Either one, this still is a bad movie or story just in general. What if this comes out, everyone's looking forward to it and it still sucks. That's going to suck. It's like that's how gonna... they keep making remakes of Blade Runner. It's just like, you're not... That's going to hurt. It's going to hurt. Yeah. It... But what if, as you said earlier, what if this is good? 
then what happens to Wonder Everything. Woman, Wonder Woman uh, 84, Because what's canon? Aquaman 2, what's canon? Shazam 2, yep. what? Because we've already, we kind of like, okay, Justice League happened, uh, let's just... Let's, you're you know, destabilizing uh, your world. Yes. The nascent world that you're trying to build and have had a couple of really good successes with and a couple of failures with after Justice League that are like, okay, we kind of have something here, we kind of know what we're going for, and now you're going back... <sighs> To get the thing on, you swept under the rug and bring back that if you retroactively make it good, what happens to this? Like, what's like maybe the plan this movie acknowledges this? the television shows. Like maybe after all the Ezra Miller drama, they're just gonna bring in the Flash from the TV show, and then Snyder's like, man, these TV shows are part of it. Ha ha. Like, well, uh, they, what? They, they did. They already, they already did that. How do they already do that? Did you obviously didn't watch Crisis on Infinite no, Earths? No. But there was a moment in the last no. episode where Ezra Miller showed up as like as the Flash. With uh, Grant's Flash, and they're like, "Oh my, there are other Flashes out there." And 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 Ezra Miller is like, "Oh, so I, I was right. I gotta tell Cyborg. Oh man, he's gonna freak out when he hears about this." Like it was, Grant is my Flash. Ezra Miller is a really bad Flash. He can't run. Hopefully, the twenty million dollars for this, they reshoot all of him run, running and can train him how to run. Currently on the screen, a looping is him running weird. He he's a weird runner. He's a weird runner. They gotta train that guy. He's got floppy legs. Even and at super speed, floppy legs. You gotta run into stuff. I'm just yeah, saying, you're gonna break a lamb. He's not. He's not a good runner. Hopefully, they, they can fix that in post. Uh, as they're fixing everything in post, apparently in this movie. But like, if, if this is a success, how does it impact all the other movies they're gonna make? I don't know, man. I don't think it's a good idea. I don't think this is a good idea. Because either way, no matter what happens, if it's good or bad, you're messing with your future plans that you're trying to get things going. But hopefully, everything works out. Everyone, apparently, everyone's coming this back This all being said, it. we're definitely going to watch this. I, yeah, I look for <laughs> like I hope this is good. Yeah. I hope it's good. D- DC's hurt me enough or like not, has not come through enough that I'm worried that it still won't come through. Yeah. And I hope that Henry can shave. I hope that it was part of the contract this time of like, hey, well, and The Witcher was clean shaven for the most part, maybe a little scruff, but like yeah. that's easily shavable. But like, hopefully, and he's not in any of the Mission Impossibles because he didn't make it through the last one. So hopefully, spoilers, spoilers, he's not in any project that requires him to shave or requires him not to shave because like, we need a, we need a fresh faced Superman when he comes back. Yeah. Because he's still, remember, we still got to do that. He still has to come back from the dead and whatever this is. Uh, so like, hi. <sighs> Uh, yeah, I really don't know how I feel about this, but I'm, I'm afraid this is probably not going to be a good idea. But we'll see, aren't we? Next year. He's going to make it to next year. <laughs> He's got to make it to next year. We'll see. The fun thing will be that if we like the Snyder Cut, we can come back to this one and just reshoot it that we think it's great and it's going to be awesome. Yeah, we'll spend $20 yep. to reshoot this this actual episode. I got then, $20 million. We could do that. You got $20 million lying around? Yeah. You didn't tell me? No. Oh man, we're gonna really gussied up the studio, but uh, you know right. what? You didn't ask nicely. I guess I, I just thought. I'd, please and thank you goes a long way. Yeah, I never say please and thank you. I'm a twenty millionaire. I, I just expect. Yeah. Uh, what do you guys think of this? Of the Zack Snyder cut of Justice League coming out next year? Yeah, where are you guys at? Cause like, yeah. Do you see the light at the end of this tunnel? Cause I don't. Let us know what you think down below in the comments. And also, while you're down there, please like, subscribe, and hit that bell. Do that YouTube that you do so well. Guacamole's extra. You reshot weirdos, you. If we don't like your comments, we're just going to spend $20 million to reshoot. Yeah, we'll reshoot it. <laughs> we'll, do it. we'll do it again. Do it again. <laughs> back, back to one, everybody. I'll shave off my mustache, and we'll just get it typing. <laughs> All right, other videos are popping up here. Please watch those. We would appreciate it as much as we appreciate you watching this one. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.